What up, everybody? We are back with some more Tom McDonald. We got Blame the Rappers featuring Dax. Um, two incredible artists. Definitely not a combination that I expected to see. But we're going to get into it. Y'all make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and let's go. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a rapper, but I'm losing my respect for the genre. How many songs about Xanax and alcohol are we dropping? How many kids we gonna kill for we admit it's a problem? Probably stop if it was one of us. I'm gonna say this every song. This man gets straight to the point every time. He don't waste no time. It's first 10 seconds. He's already saying something that's that hits. How many kids we gonna kill for we admit it's a problem Probably stop if it was one of us sons or one of our daughters We know our demographic is primarily youth We glorify breaking the law to children in school Kids copy what we see and imitate what we do They'll go to jail for doing the things you thought them was cool We put women in our videos exploiting their bodies While little girls around the world grab their phone and they watch it They need a realistic role model, not just a Barbie They see strippers and escorts but no lawyers or doctors Hey hip hop, what the hell happened? It was power to the people and we like that stuff These days you're promoting that it's fun to be an addict so I'm asking how could y'all write that, bruh? You can blame the rap. Now, this is seems to be very similar to Dear Rappers. Um, but yeah, he's talking some serious stuff. It's like, how can you consciously write that and not feel bad about it? Like, it's very selfish, very irresponsible. You're telling these little kids it's cool to be a drug dealer, cool to do drugs, cool to go to jail, and then they grow up and do it because they imitate their favorite artist. privilege and a choice and if you ever get to be successful you must understand the people that you influence i swear by what you say and that the melodies you sing make wings build dreams and fill voids we got medication straight through voice some give life and some destroy and even though this money seems nice it can't some give life and some destroy that is facts a lot of uh, it's you have you have a lot of artists that are telling you to do the right thing and providing great content like these two for example and then you have artists that are just straight trash man they tell you what people don't need to be hearing you must understand the people that you influence i swear by what you say and that the melodies you sing make wings build dreams and fill voids we got medication straight through voice some give life and some destroy and even though this money seems nice it can't come so we must take that as a hit that there's other things in life we should enjoy we move mountains we cross states we play roles in presidential debates so don't you try and tell me making music is for fun and you don't care about the things that our music helped make man i know i'm not perfect but i'll change i'm the outcome of this world and my pain and this music is pills and i promise this dose that you take won't make you say you can blame the rappers when you blow up but your favorite song so this is this is great this song because these two um a subject like this is right up both of their alleys and it's something that they both speak on very often is you know trash rappers making trash music about with horrible subject matters and to see them them collab like this it's we need more more of this more collabs like this that I'm embarrassed. 
Half of these artists can't even talk, they just mumble the lyrics. And the teenagers listen while they rebel from their parents, while the rappers... I watched the interview. Um, I believe it was NBA Youngboy. Bro, that man cannot speak English. Like, if you watch that video of him, his interview, he is not speaking English. There's a few of the newer rappers that are like that. You cannot understand anything they are saying. It's it's tough. Tell them pop a pill by Gucci and wear it. They say screw the police, break the real smoke. I'm a rapper, but I swear that I'm embarrassed. Half of these artists can't even talk. They just mumble the lyrics. And the teenagers listen while they rebel from their parents. While the rappers tell them pop a pill by Gucci and wear it. They say screw the police, break the real smoke weed. Buy some shoes you don't need, rep the hood in your street. All these rappers holding guns and now the kids want some. Mess around and kill they homie, you can't clean that blood. We encourage being stupid with our music. And we're normalizing poor moral standards while we do it. Little boys see the way that women look on our videos and assume it's real life. Project that image on little girls. It's unrealistic. If you're young and you listen, you are one in a million. You are loved. You are different. Hey, hip hop. I know life moves on, but while I'm here, how could you write that, dog? You can blame the rappers that you blow up, but your favorite song are about doing drugs. So what happens? Now, see, when I grew up, the rappers were talking about selling drugs and becoming hustlers and learning to be businessmen. They would sell drugs to then go legit, to have make enough money to then go legit. These dudes nowadays are taking drugs. It's all it's just full circle. It's all backwards. Oh, yeah, that was Tom McDonald featuring Dax or Blame the Rappers. Um, definitely a very, very great song, great subject, uh, kind of a touchy subject because, you know, people will, like the kids nowadays, they will say, oh, you know, we listen to music because it's fun, it's a vibe, not realizing that that's where they're learning from and they're imitating it and it's not teaching them anything anything of value um you know i grew up on like you know artists that had values i listened to talib kwali lupe fiasco like rappers that were teaching you giving you knowledge so you can do better in your life the dudes now just shoot guns hang out with some chicks do some drugs like it's corny but that's tom mcdonald featuring dax Blame the rappers. Y'all hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. And let's get it.